Alright, this is Whip Hill Warrior, human whip attentive, whip attentive every single day. Oh yeah. So I'm going to make this like a wheeled uh, one off, slats two off, and combined. Where I have this whole video put online, and I'm going to cut it in half basically, and put it in, like two different other videos. Does that make sense? But anyways, but yeah, silver versus Bitcoin. <laughs> <laughs> I always thought that, you know, socialists were weak. They didn't want to do, you know, the hard work. Of course, I always love doing the hard work. Yeah, I get down to it. But yeah, yeah. Bitcoin is exactly like what you see right here. You know, you got your wanes, you know. <laughs> uh, uh, it's separate. Let's just say that. <laughs> it's not about the material value, the will value you can't use a actual Bitcoin <laughs> to make anything with. So it doesn't have actual value. It's basically like money. It's basically like currency. I uh, understand. <laughs> However, silver actually has quite a bit of value to it. It has a lot of backing. Silver has so much backing, it's almost scary. Alright, so does gold, but there's a lot more things silver goes into. Understand? I know this. A lot of people know this. And that's how it was going to be. You are not going to be able to replace actual metals. This is a lot. And I like to make it known. I like to state that Dr. Sam Muggsy and Kent Dunn is nowhere near as much of a financial advisor as I am. But I'm not educated also necessarily. But I am, however, educated in super common sense. Material value. Always remember. See, I know the aliens, ETs, they love. Oh my god, they love ignoring the sensual itsu. The sensual itsu. It's true. They always ignore the central itsu. Uh -huh. I say uh, they uh, really effed up what they have done. Yeah, they should have evacuated the humans and then clean up everything, mow things over quickly. Of course, you know, help anyone else. There might have been just as much less death and suffering. Who knows? And then let us come back separated, of course. From the not humans, clone alien hybrids are innocent. Why? Ugh. And figure out everything after that. But no, no. It's going to be death, mass destruction, so on and so forth. Anyway, yeah, that's that's very logical. So I mean, if ETs are will, uh, think about that. It's it'd be like uh, as threatening as the day the Earth stood still. Yeah, watch that one. Yeah, that's a uh, yeah going to be just like that, isn't it? Very illogical. Swears, but to train properly, educate, common sense, no, any of that, no, but yet yeah, we're going to go through some loopy loops, right? Oh, whatever. Back to what I was, so, so here we are faced with Bitcoin. You think you're going to go with that in a how would I say post monetary system to get some groceries from a store with army? Guides everywhere. You're going to, what, exchange a hard drive or something like that with uh, 10,000 <coughs> Bitcoin or whatever, or Dogecoin or whatever you got. You think you're going to get the same material <laughs> value over ones and zeros as you would actual a $50 coin, silver coin from, let's say, eBay or Amazon? You think you're going to get the same material value you think you're gonna get same material value common sense from a hard drive with ones and zeros of cryptocurrency basically made up money when times get rough than actual physical material backed like it has promise to be used for a lot of technology and stuff right assuming that it don't all go away which is highly unlikely at this point. Too much of it.
Now let's think about this. Wooly, wooly, wooly hard, okay? Wooly hard. Okay, maybe let's try not think about too hard. Let's try to use some very simplistic common sense. The world don't spin, so don't invest your hard-earned money into ones and zeros. Understand? Uh, you do you not understand that? If the world is not spinning, maybe you should think about not investing in ones and zeros. Do you not understand? I will explain it to you. It's called a matrix. Ones and zeros, you know, reference. I know, right? Jeez, come on, think about it. Oh, yeah. Jeez, why would you spend your hard-earned money that you enslaved yourself here for to actually buy ones and zeros when you could buy something more, how would I say, of material value that can be used? Like, think about that. What is more useful? Some socialist currency or actual gold and silver, huh? Silver more affordable, so get a lot of that. Not gonna be useful, trust me. Trust me. Especially when you are uh, having a uh, upset stomach because you uh, can't down the worms and grass like you uh, thought you could. Yeah, you would be wishing that you had a coin once a week. For sure, but hey, you know what? Don't have to listen to me. I mean, let's look at gravity. I pretty sure nothing wrong with that. I mean, I mean, I pretty sure had nothing to do with mass and volume or density, right? I pretty sure they could be teaching this in school, right? Uh, have they? I'm pretty sure they have. I mean, no, wait, they haven't? Holy shit. Jeez, because they don't want you to be smart enough in school. They want workers. They want you to be just just smart enough. And socialists, by the way. Oh, that's why they got all these prom dances and stuff like that. They sell sex. They try to sell the sex and the socialism as some type of worth. And that's how you got sucked into its ones and zeros, not actual material value that actually get you places like all these rich people. I had this uh, one uh, cab, you cabby driver or something like that, whatever cab driver it was, anyways, who were talking about Warren Buffett and how you, uh, how he going to do what he did with bonds and stuff like that. Like, are you, are you serious? Jeez. I mean, the clone alien hybrids are almost like teachers indirectly. I mean, I was like, even want to question his sanity, even... See, so, I mean, <laughs> yeah, if you call that being a teacher. Being insane is being a good teacher, so you don't want to be insane like that individual being insane. Are you serious? Wow. Yeah, I guess uh, scale tactics is a great way to learn quite a bit. Like, you would get scared of <laughs> that stupidity, the insanity. I swear to God. <laughs> Uh, uh, you honestly think Warren Buffett going to actually tell you how to become wits and uh, successful? Are you serious? You know how much copper he got in his mansions? <laughs> think about it. <laughs> Jeez, I swear. And just wait. Just wait see how everything develops. If things go south, if things go south, don't be surprised. Don't be surprised. If materials are desired more than ones and zeros. Now uh, let me continue with what I, what I have in mind in this video. Yeah, it's the link down below. Yeah, I know. But nonetheless, though, this is actually a photo, one of many that I have used in my... Oh, shit, the whole channel got taken down. Damn it. But nonetheless, I still got the photos anyways. But yeah, this is like back in the day, 4th of July cookout with my dad's friend. And it was a great cookout, I'm telling you though. But you know, I get hungry being out on the streets homeless and not being able to have good quality videos for everyone that need the good quality. Yeah, I'm not homeless anymore, but this is a video from back in the day. I'm going to implement it yeah, like a blast from the past type of thing. But anyways, 
But yeah, totally. Like, if you think you uh, saved a lot of money listening to me, then Muggsy and Kent, Dr. Sam Muggsy and Kent Dunn, you mean fake doctor. Anyways, hey, you know, don't buy into the ones and zeros or zeros and one. Most of them are zeros. Oh, and that's a good type. Oh, buy into material currency. It's backed by value. Trust me. Don't listen to those idiots. Those idiots are stupid. So, yeah, uh, continue this uh, video, A Blast from the Past, when I was homeless and when I did need help and no one was wanting me to help. So then I can help others. Yeah, I wonder how much copper is in Warren Buffett's bloodline. <laughs> Get it, copperhead snake. <laughs> So, you know, I mean, I don't care who you are, 144K, blah, 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 or, you know, uh, what Tillian High Boy, whatever, trying to redeem themselves, blah, blah, blah. I don't care who you are. You know, it, there's a link down below in the description box. You know, head towards it. If you want to actually feed this human story white man, and so he can motivate himself to actually do content like this more, let me know, because no one does, apparently. You could save the world against bullshit. But no, not only is this only human straight white man out here on YouTube making content that is a biggest platform for what? I suppose it was supposed to be for free speech, but <laughs> and keep getting censored. No other alternatives are as good as YouTube, apparently. <laughs> Who knew? I don't need $500 a month. I mean, not unless you are for truth and justice and somehow sane, I suppose. I guess I have no right to deny you of helping me out. But I pretty much got everything where well, I was wanting it initially back in the day. But yeah, I'm too busy butting heads with the aliens that are here doing things that are not good. The ET aliens are being serious. They ain't doing good. They, they are losing common sense, I swear to God. Almost like they're trying to take from you more than not. I mean, I don't, I don't understand. But anyways, uh, also Alex Caller, they ain't that many Alex Callers, so they don't have a problem with that too. Like, those is a, a lot of separation, division with humanity, will humanity. I mean, so it's too many demon clone replicants, I swear to God. Anyways, so... Yeah, think about this. All this time, everyone was losing money because they wasn't placing it in certain ways. Also, there is no helping of the whites. Yeah, you uh, trust those who speak the their trust out of their mouth. The word out of the mouth is their trust. And they uh, literally speak to your soul. More like they will steal your soul. Oh, and your wallet. Oh, yeah. I ain't going to deny that there is a problem out here. There is a big problem. But when you got these aliens here who has a responsibility to do and say things correctly and they ain't doing it, I have a problem with that. That's a bull. But nonetheless, though, not only am I the only one. A human straight white man, or just a human alone, just going up against all these damn not human android hybrids of uh, reptilian, draconian, glades, and mantis. But man, I am poorly funded. But you know, if you want me to make the superior content in the future, and even better, I'm gonna need the dough, I'm gonna need the goods. I won't need anything you can get me. I don't care if it's $5. I don't care if it's $50. I don't care if it's $500 a month. Whatever it is, I appreciate it. You know how much I appreciate it? I mean, it's not necessarily what I can do. It's what you can do. You better yourself, myself, and anyone else, right? Because I tried everything, and I'm just like... So we're going to let this video fly out there and just like, and probably going to be one of the very few that I have of great quality on this new channel. So it's your move, not mine. My house chief of staff, Mark Meadows, here's the clip. Hey everyone, before I uh, finish the clip, 
That guy had a 666 symbol on his shirt. He's one of them. They're all one of them. They're like 99.99% of them versus us humans and whatever Kent Dunn says with his pals, 144,000 or whatever. We are clearly outnumbered, and i am being thrown out in streets. Update alert, update alert. Yeah, I'm not homeless anymore, and I'm not planning on being homeless ever again. Oh, but yeah, watch this old clip of mine. Uh, yeah, one of my recent videos on this channel. Yeah, oh yeah. Let's continue the clip. It's getting uh, pretty insane. Good afternoon, everyone. We just finished a two-hour meeting with Secretary Mnuchin and the, the Chief of Staff Meadows. Wait a second, you saw that hand sign, the hidden hand, and you saw her messing around with her with tile neck, I swear. Yeah, getting all that wetty and stuff, oh yeah. It's all signs and symbols. It's all signs and symbols. Look at it again. Good afternoon, everyone. We just finished a two-hour meeting with Secretary Mnuchin and the chief of staff meadows ah look at it look at it again one more time and see that she touches both her earrings when she touches her scarf yeah and it ain't the only thing i could point out good good it was productive we're moving down the track uh, we still have our differences we are trying to have a clearer understanding of of uh of what the needs are we, we all know the needs, and we'll get to that in a moment at the end of this clip. What you say, how you say it, you say it on purpose because you are what you are. You are a snake, you are a reptilian, and you are panicking right now because the pals that are, are crumbling, can't protect you. I know what you're trying to do, you try to keep us humans from actually being successful. So I keep the currency from us so we don't go cyber warrior, you asses, like I'm doing right now. Yeah. And the needs are this, that millions of children in our country are food insecure. And the needs are this, that millions of children in our country are food insecure. Are food insecure. Are food insecure. Are food insecure. <laughs> Funny enough that I saw that DVD sometime before making this video, I forgot when, but yeah, I took a picture of it at Dollar Tree, <laughs> I kind of still gave a funny look about that, but uh, I'm pretty sure they saw what I was uh, taking a photo of, yeah, I know what, so I want to screenshot that, because uh, that's a good uh, pic right there, good for, good for memes, yeah. Now, I know, I know, I know what you're going to be saying. You're going to be saying, but where pill? I, I know that she is getting older and decrepit. Like an old hag she is, probably a tranny. Who knows? But, you know, you see a lot of conspiracies about trannies, that damn gender, they say they are. Yeah, like any Annalino, Annalino, Jolie, I think that's how you say her name. <laughs> Tomb Raider, basically. Yeah, that's a guy. Look at that sex scene or smooch scene or whatever that was. And yeah. I know that was a uh, Hillary Clinton or Hitlery Clinton, but still, let's bear with it, okay? <coughs> okay, but being serious though, I mean, not only is a lot of things going on behind the scenes, but they know what they saying, they know what they going after. She could be old and decrepit, but she could actually be accidentally or relaying a message, nonetheless. Yeah, yeah, she could be old, senile, and she let it slip because that's what they were talking about. Or it was actually a message to be sent to all those who are around that are they live. That are among us, that are reptilian, draconian, and who knows what else, puppets. Because they all are puppets. They are just here to take our human ascending DNA by second, by second. 
All right, to finish this off, I got the pick already. Yeah. But anyways, back to what? To finish this all off, yeah, they're going to die before they give up their thrones. They will die before they give up their thrones. Understand that? They will die before they do that. So here we got all this information, and what in conclusion that we get from all this, simple. They're going to be a person no matter what until they are either. Well, I think they should be captured for execution, trials, and stuff. But if that don't happen, you know, there will be no justice for humanity.